If you uh, look on the back of a bottle of the last drop, it will say 120 years of experience in a bottle. That's because we three who are friends have got more than 120 years of experience and we go back a long way. I think the name came first because then we realized if we said the last drop, we could find whiskey which was literally the last drop. What we were looking for was the last parcels of whiskey of all sorts that we could sell in these minute quantities of this one of which there's only one, three, four, seven bottles. That's it, done. So it is the last drop before there is no more, which is our other slogan. We wanted a bottle that would reflect the seriousness of it. We didn't want to have pompous, heavy, expensive packaging because we work on the theory that the person buying the last drop can afford more expensive bottles than we can. We wanted the liquid inside those bottles to be the hero. And this is the one that we thought stood out miles above all the others for being just coming up to 50 years old, really. But this one is really astonishing. I mean, it's very brisk, it's very lively, it's quite sweet. It doesn't have too much wood, it doesn't have too much anything. It has an enormous complication of taste, which goes on to the bottom of the glass. And as I said somewhere, the, the glass itself will smell of the wood and the whiskey for another day, if you leave it alone. This whiskey was blended 36 years ago from 70 malts and 12 grains. All of which were 12 years old or older then. Or older then. So we, all we can tell you is that it is at least 1960. But quite a lot of the whiskey there is considerably older, but we can't publish that statement. We can, we can only let you decide for yourself. We are three friends. There are no titles in this company. It's just friends having, having fun and doing what we want to do. So we found what we thought was the perfect blend, and it's of the highest possible quality. We only have 1,347 bottles to release worldwide, and that's what we wanted. We wanted people to realize how lucky they are to get it. So it's not an arrogant statement, it's just that there is no more. Now, Tom, I'm getting very thirsty. This is driving me to drink. It's time to stop. Time to stop? <laughs> Maybe it's time for a drop of the last to, drop. Time to stop talking rubbish and drink a drink. <laughs> Cheers.